Repair Clinic makes fixing things easy. With millions of replacement parts available on our website and the help you need to do the repair yourself. Since we encourage you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the carburetor on your string trimmer, make sure the engine has cooled. Next, remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. Loosen the knob to release the air filter cover. Remove the filter and use an 8mm socket or nut driver to unthread the air filter housing mounting nuts. Lift up the choke lever and remove the housing. Detach the throttle cable from the carburetor. Note the orientation of the fuel lines, then detach them to fully remove the old carburetor. Lift up the cable mount to remove the old gasket. You're now ready to install the new carburetor. Slide the gasket onto the mounting posts. Attach the fuel lines to the appropriate carburetor ports. Attach the Z end of the throttle cable to the carburetor. Now align the carburetor on the mounting posts. Confirm that the cable mount is properly positioned, then push the carburetor into place. With the choke lever up, realign the air filter housing and secure it with the nuts. Open the choke and replace the air filter. Reposition the air filter cover and tighten the knob to secure. With the repair completed, reattach the wire in boot to the spark plug. Keep in mind you may need to reset the idle by tightening or loosening the adjustment screw before your string trimmer will be ready for use. At Repair Clinic, we make fixing things easy. Thank you for supporting the production of these videos by purchasing your parts from our website.